Hello guys, here we are again to talk about Sardinia in September. Um, I wanted to write an article about what to do in Sardinia in sept September. You have to know that sometimes in September and October you can also find not very good weather um, or, or fantastic weather, I it depends on the year. For example, this uh, um, last week of August was very, um, was very cloudy and sometimes and <laughs> three day we had three days of, of rain and so all the people that are coming to my bed and breakfast uh, asked me okay what, what what we can do what we can do because it's raining you know we we came here to uh, to um, to swim we, we we came here to uh, to to have the sun of our skin we we wanted our holidays on the on the beach Okay, uh, it's strange if, if you're coming, I don't know, like one week in Sardinia, um, it's strange if you find uh, five, uh, five days completely of bad weather, okay? But sometimes can happen. What we can do? I wrote an, a specific uh, article on my blog. I will write you down so you can have uh, very good, more detailed uh, information about this. Uh, but uh, the first thing I can tell you is that in Sardinia, even if it's raining you have uh, a lot of things to do and you can have um, a lot of um, uh, you can anyway enjoy your holiday <coughs> okay and uh, because even if uh, for those days um, uh, these days you you don't go to the beach you can you can make different activities for example you can uh, enjoy uh, the typical food of Sardinia so you can try the experience of agritourism of farms and uh, you can go there and you can discover this wonderful side of Sardinia um, and to to have contact with Sardinian people that to me is is the best so you you can know the big the, 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 the true hospitality of Sardinia and in these farms uh, you can hit this menu of typical food like handmade pasta handmade you can taste handmade wines and uh, also meat and uh, you can see around a lot of animals so you can um, enjoy uh, the real nature of Sardinia so uh, you will have a lot of things to to tell to friends and family of course when you will come back you 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 will enjoy your holiday anyway and uh, this is the first thing. Oh, uh, if it's raining, raining, what what you can do? Uh, you of course you can. Um, I don't know. You can visit some ancient village because Sardinia is full of ancient villages and full of um, history. And it's very fascinating co to have a walk in these villages. For example, near Olbia. Um, I talk. Uh, I talked about um, about it in my article. Near Olbia, we have, for example, San Pantaleo. Near Costa Smeralda, we have Posada with the castle and it's very very nice to walk and to discover all the artisanship and so you can uh, also know uh, that side of Sardinia that you um, that is not so uh, sponsorized so um, before coming to Sardinia you know mm, you you have these images only of the coast of the sun and um, and other things and uh, so mm, the the bad weather sometimes can be uh, the, mm, the the mm, can be uh, a moment in which you can uh, discover the true, the true of the island that is uh, wonderful. So you can discover these, uh, these ancient villages. But we have a lot um, uh, in all the areas of Sardinia. For example, uh, near Nuoro, uh, we have Oliana, we have Orgosolo, uh, we have Lula, we have Orune. Mm, um, are all little small villages that you can easily reach even if you are um, you're sleeping. Uh, I don't know in a hotel or in a camping on the coast and you can reach it easily uh, the internal internal very internal areas are a little bit hard to uh, to reach but um, or in case you you, you decided uh, to to visit the internal areas and you you are all um, already there uh, but anyway if you um, if you are in a specific part of Sardinia also in the coast and, and the weather is not very good uh, you have um, a lot of places to visit also the museum uh, uh, museums so um, uh, little uh, little museums 
Oh, you can also book uh, different excursions that are, are not on the um, on the sea, not by boat. Uh, we have a lot of things, uh, really, and um, especially uh, on the side of nature. And um, just so, in, if you want some ideas, uh, just uh, write me. Uh, you can write me here on YouTube. You can write me uh, through my blog. Sorry for my hair; they are terrible <laughs> today. <laughs> and uh, and I would be very glad to to help see you